Sam Boyd Stadium as 20 Rebels will play for the last time here on this field. As for head coach Tony Sanchez, he looks to grab his fourth one of the season. They'll give him the most wins for a first year head coach since Jeff Horn in 94. Now let's take a look at some highlights. Let's keep playing. Guys didn't just lay down. Again, they just got beat up. I mean, you're looking at guys just physically getting moved off the ball. You know, we couldn't run the football. They were they were gashing us. We made really bad decisions with the ball. You know, in our hands tonight at the quarterback position, um, missed a lot of wide open receivers. Had some drop balls. Um, one of those turns, I think, bounced off one of our guys. You know, helmets. I mean, it's just a lot of. I don't think there were lack of effort, lack of focus. Lack, you know, it's late in the year. You know, it's week 11. A lot of our guys are not used to fighting this deep into the season, and it showed tonight. Competitive maturity. You know, we talk about that all the time with our guys. We 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 lack competitive maturity right now. It was just disappointing. Uh, you know, we knew they were a good team coming into this, but we didn't feel like the, that score reflected how how good of a team we are. And you know, it got away early, and it was frustrating just because. You know, we we felt like we could compete with them, and you know, it just got away fast, and we were playing from behind the whole night. So it, it was it was definitely frustrating, and uh, we just got to have a better game next week. You know, I think it's tough. It was tough for the seniors, but um, we just got to move on. We'll we'll, fi we'll figure out what we did wrong tomorrow, and we'll move on and get ready for next week.
With a 52-14 loss, the Rebels dropped to 3-8 for the season. After the game, head coach Tony Sanchez said this is the first time all season that the Rebels weren't in it all the way and they got their, quote, tails whipped. The Rebels are going to try to right the ship as they head to Wyoming next weekend for their season finale. For the Rebel Report, I'm Barbara Farkas.